Hey guys, this is May Monty and shout out to Chi Town Urban Radio. Yeah. Snow Archangel and Band of the Hawk. We got grind season in here. Season. This is the Chi Town Urban Radio. Yes, sir. Yeah. It's all good, man. Hey, man, it's the one and only DJ Malone. And your girl, Ebony Kiera. Man, it's Sci-Town Number 8. We're live in Houston, baby. <laughs> Ain't nobody gonna clap? Ain't nobody gonna just say yay or hey or whatever? Hey, hey. <laughs> hey man, welcome, man. We've been now, Ebony. We gotta put together this bit. Now, I'm, I'm gonna break it down to you who she is, okay? I'm gonna tell you. If she gonna, she gonna tell you who she is. But I'm gonna tell you what what she's done already. Okay. This how you know when somebody's real. So, 90 percent of people that I meet, probably everybody almost in this room right now, I met somehow online. Mm -hmm. And the power of you know internet and everything else like that. So when she hit me, she was like, Hey, you know, I, I see that you you know coming in with the side town of a radio thing. I'm gonna try to do something. Okay, cool. So, mind you, now I don't know where she lives, but I yesterday, uh, what thing what, what was that? Yesterday on Friday? Yeah. Okay, I, I did a gig out in the in the white boy lane. I don't like saying that, but it, it was out there. It was, it was a long drive. This how dedicated she is. He came all the way up there, said, "Hey, I'm gonna come check you out." I was DJing at the school. Came out there, mind you. How long? How, how long? How long was that drive for you? Oh, like an hour. Now, even though that doesn't, that doesn't mean that, yeah, 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 yeah. but it was the simple fact that she was only there for a little amount of time. Mm -hmm. So, for her to even do that, it's dedication, you know what I'm saying? So, tell the people who you need to Hi, I'm Mia Fryer, I'm a promo model and a fashion model. <laughs> we, all, we all gotta love the models, man. I got that from the hype. Yes. I kind of just figured, I'm like, I wonder, but I was just guessing in my head. <laughs> oh. How tall are you? I'm six feet. I also play basketball at SMU. Okay. What, what, what position are you? I played the three and the four. Okay. I bet she can dunk a mile at my life. <laughs> you, know how, you know how low I feel as a man that another, another woman who's that tall? I mean, I mean, I know I'm a short guy, but God damn! <laughs> So, anyways, <laughs> um, so how did you get into modeling? Well, I did it because I was a college basketball player and obviously I wanted to make my own business and this is the way I wanted to do it. Real, okay, okay, so how did you go about getting into it? When I say into it, how, who, who did you contact, who did you, you know, find out or who influenced you to do something like that? The person who influenced me, I believe, was my mother. She was actually on TV as well, okay. part time, and then also my father. I believe, I think, family was the main, the main supporter. Okay, so family kind of just really just they kind of pushed me through, you know, supported me, kept okay. me going. Okay, so. definitely. Have any any questions? Because y'all both models. So. How old are you? I'm 23. Have you ever tried like doing the hair? Like some model. I want to, but I've been really busy in college. I'm a pre-law major. She, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about, beauty and brain. God damn it. <laughs> so, definitely, man. So, so when, what school, so what school you go to again? I'm sorry. Texas Southern University. Texas Southern University. So, are you from here? No, I'm actually not. TSU. TSU, okay, 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 okay. So, okay. so, um, you're, your, your rival with Prairie View. Yes. So, so where are you from? I'm actually from a town called Keller, Texas. It's outside of Fort Worth. Okay. okay. How far is that from here? About four hours. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> See, that's how big Texas is. It's like, yeah. it's like I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, um, so with the modeling, so you do promotion modeling and yes. stuff? Yes. Okay, so who have you worked for thus far? I work for Nickelodeon for the Super Bowl premiere promotions. Push models, first okay. class models. I work for BET, okay. the new edition that's coming out. The new, what do you mean the new edition? The, the new edition, the show. Oh, oh. I work okay. for them. Okay. 
She getting it. I wish I, I could. Know, that's right. I wish I could be on BET. They would never pick me up. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could be. Okay, so um, when you're in that lane, as far, you know, Nickelodeon is a big corporate, you know, a big deal. So, as you're in the corporate lane, how is it important to brand yourself in 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 a way that is not gonna harm you? In, I guess in a sense. It's very important to me. I always would like respect. I want to let people know that working hard will get you places. Yeah. You know, just being beautiful is not enough. I want to show women that going to college, playing sports, modeling, you can do all of that thing. All of that. Real. Okay. So. Definitely, man. Um, Ebony, I'm, uh, I'm, I don't know if, if this is an appropriate question, but is there any advice you could give to her, um, you know, as far as the modeling? That's a good question. Um, Every time someone asks, <laughs> it's just funny because I get younger girls that look at me. She doesn't know me, but you know, I get younger girls that come to my page and ask that same question. So I always kind of get, what's the word I'm looking for? I always kind of get sensitive on the situation because when you see the girls like you and who actually aspire, who really wanted to be a model, I kind of just got thrown in there. So. This is what I went to school for to do. So it's like when I think model, I'm like, okay, how can I give it advice when I didn't even really want to be one? So it's kind of like, okay. Um, as far as modeling goes, I, number one advice, stay true to what you want your look to be. Like don't try, okay, how can I say this? Don't let like photographers or like, let me rephrase, sorry. <laughs> Stay true to your brand. That's what I'm trying to say. Stay true to what you want your look to be and not necessarily what quote unquote may sell. As in, you know, sex sales. So I don't know what you know what kind of photo shoots you may have done, but if that's not where your lane is supposed to be, I would stay clear from it. Instead of this is like a big old campaign like Victoria's Secret, okay? Stay, stay away from it. And I only say that because as I got into doing like lingerie and glam and the urban modern world, it's not as big as like, you know, music videos and everything. That world is not as big as it used to be. Really, really. Urban models ain't getting paid. <laughs> They're not. So, and I don't know if people know that, but it is the truth. I mean, you got people back in the 90s like Melissa Ford who actually were getting paid the stack of money to be in Jay-Z's video or Nas or whatever the case is. But now, you got the video models, you know, doing the Migos or doing, I don't know, 21 Savage, just to throw names out there like that. Those guys are not paying $1,215, $2,000 money. Urban modeling is, is not what people think it is. So I would stay, not stay clear. I mean, if you want to do music videos, that's totally fine. But I would just stay as a brand, stay as a brand, stay like in the lane that you want to be in. Don't try to venture up. Ben no, I'm not saying don't venture, but just stay like if you won't have a certain look you want to be stay in that area that's kind of what i say invest is another invest 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 invest, invest. Yes. It, yes. It, yes. especially if that's really really where you want to go like if you're looking for the bigger campaigns like the l'oreal's the maybelline's the victoria's secret that that's actually where the money is you know that's what I'm so yeah, that's, that's, that, that's the key word. Two, two big things. Stay where you want to be. Like as far as your brand, don't let anyone kind of push you into anything you really don't want to do. Yeah. So. Like, you know, like somebody puts me trying to give me the word tutu. I was. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, like, I ain't with all that. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, man. I'm not with all that. I'm a boy gaming. <laughs> so, um, that's the see, see here the key word though. Invest. I can't tell you um, when I buy banners or when I do something to help build my brand, you're going to have to put money into it. And, and for somebody to really take you seriously, it, it has to has to. You've got to put in money to get money to get it out. So, um, let me ask you a real question. Okay. How do you deal with creepos? <laughs> do you have mace or something? I actually do. Got okay. it from Cabela's. What woman doesn't carry mace? We, I'm pretty. I'm sure everyone does. You have a gun. Okay. I do not. Okay. I do not have a gun. You're not, <laughs> you're not just saying it because you're on air. Yeah, I'm not just saying that. Okay. On air. Okay. All right, then. All right. Well, you gotta protect yourself either way. I mean, I'm just saying. Uh, I, I have a chaser, but I can't have any guns anymore. So, 
It's, that's just me. Anyways, we went to a dark place. Now we're back. Now. <laughs> so, um, who would you like to work with, photographer-wise? You know, I'm pretty much open to you know anybody because I'm just starting out. So, you know, I keep my books open. You know, I want to work with people who are you know coming up just like I am. I want to build, you know, build my empire with somebody maybe who's building their empire too, or somebody who already has it. Real, real. Those are the best ones, like the photographers that are kind of just coming up, especially if they're good and they don't yeah. know it yet, those are the best ones because they're just as hungry as you are. So real, real. you get to, their work, you get both of you guys work put out there. And yeah. that's stuff. Okay. That's what it is. And I, I, was, I do a little bit of photography, but I'm not, I'm not, I wouldn't call myself a photographer. I just, it, it helps me not have to pay somebody else. That's just basically what it is for. I mean, I'm a cheap guy. Uh, I, I, my first date, I'll, I'll probably take you out to Red Box and we'll go to McDonald's. So, like, you know. Hmm? <laughs> I like Red Box. I, I wasn't judging here. Or oh, 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 Walk in the Park. I don't know. Either one. <laughs> Either one. Whatever, whatever cheapest. So, I'm just fucking with y'all, man. Uh, okay, so, um, as far as, you know, you building your brand and everything else like that, how was it working for Nickelodeon? Working for Nick was pretty exciting. I got to meet Keenan and Kel. Ooh. A lot of you know celebrities came through. The Texans player came through. They were a great place to work for. I would work for with them again. Okay. I was very proud to wear their shirt and advertise their wonderful commercials and TV shows that they're broadcasting. Ooh. Yes, cut the check, Nickelodeon. Yeah, yes. I'm talking about that, that big check. That's some money. Yes. Yes. I'm taking a, yes. I'm taking a word out of some money. I mean, uh, Ebony's books. <laughs> what? No, I'm saying I messed up on your name, so. Oh, I was like, what? Mm. <laughs> I forgot even what you said. Mm. <laughs> Ebony always says, uh, some money. What do you always say? Oh, no, some money. Yeah, some money, yeah. <laughs> I gotta say, so. I, I gotta stop saying that. I gotta say, cut the check. I like that better. It's better. It's cut the check. <laughs> Just cut the check. Who's your favorite uh, Nickelodeon uh, cartoon? I would have to say Spongebob Scorpion. Yes, Spongebob. Yes. I like Spongebob. I hate Spongebob. I love Spongebob. He's great. I like Doug. <laughs> Doug, Rugrats. Hey Arnold is pretty good. Yeah, Hey Arnold was my This is so off kind of topic, but it has it's a cartoon. Well, not kind of a cartoon. I watch um, Cartoon Network, Adult Swim. Oh, oh my. He knows what I'm going to say probably. You watch Bob's Burgers. Yes. Yeah. I said <laughs> Okay, see now you gotta watch about Who's your favorite character, Couple Bob? I do like Tina. No, uh, what's the sister name? What's the sister name? She's so like, I think she has ADD or something. She's always all over the place. <laughs> so I like her. I like, her. and I like the mom too. I like that. Okay, Bob's Burgers. Sorry guys, what? way off topic. What about Johnny Bravo? He, what he was on Nickelodeon. What's on now? It was like '90s, early '90s. Johnny Bravo was my man. He got. I like Johnny Bravo. He always got put down, but he always got back up. Not better than SpongeBob. Sorry. Sorry. No. Okay. How did you? What did you do work uh, for B? B did, you say, did you say new edition, right? Yes. Okay. How was it working with that? BT, of course, was my favorite experience. The management is amazing. I could see why their their channel is skyrocketing, and you know, so many people come back to it because the people that I worked with were so great. The management was great. They're respectable. They're humble, which is very important to me. Yeah. I'm gonna need your contact with BET, girl. Let me let me get in. So I need to holler at somebody over at BET. Yeah, I'm trying to get some uh, money. Uh, pay some bills. <laughs> Definitely, though, man. So, um, where can the people find you? You can find me on Instagram at Houston Model Search. Okay. And you can also find me on Facebook at Nia Fryer. Okay. N I A F R I A R. You got a model mayhem? I actually do. Okay. Uh, what, what is it? Nia Jackson. Okay, definitely. That's a good thing for models to have still as well. I know not a, not a lot of models use it anymore, but I think a lot of models should start going back into using model mayhem. Model mayhem that was good. a very good tool. And yeah, a lot of people want like to it. get in, get it, get back into that. But Instagram skyrocketed, so now everybody looks for models on Instagram. So it's like yeah. Then get scammed. But remember when we, we talked about a while back ago, nobody has headshots anymore or like a resume. Nobody has like a written or a resume. portfolio. Yeah, a portfolio written. Yeah. So, um, do you have all that? Like, yes, that? yes. I yes. said, wait, is this what I'm talking about? That's crazy because I don't even have one. I did at one point, but then I don't 
then have to look like And the business cards are also, you know, on your card. Yeah. 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 Well, I appreciate you coming through. Yeah. Um, I mean, bring your, your, your sister and yes. your people with you. you. Does he want to say anything? Um, well, um, is this working? <laughs> I just want to say follow me on Instagram. It's um, Little Miss H. Sean. I'm also a model, so. Okay. Come on. 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 Okay. You can groom her. You can groom her. No. <laughs> well, we, can, we can do something with it. Okay, cool, cool. Definitely, man. So, uh, do y'all work together on, on you know, uh, gigs and stuff like that? Yeah, we try to work, you know, together. Okay, that's what it is. Yeah, make sure y'all have each other's back. It's a doggy dog world. It's entertainment world. It's not no mm -hmm. joke. Okay? Uh, make sure y'all have each other's back. And, and if she pisses you off, just, you know, say kumbaya, y'all get over in about a day. <laughs> So that's what it is, <laughs> man. Hey, give it a Facebook, Twitter, everything where they can find you one more time. You can find me on Facebook at Nia Fryer, and you can find me on Instagram, Houston Model Show. Okay, cool, man, definitely. Uh, we got my guy coming up, Money Make Bugsy, coming up, man. I really do appreciate him coming through. Hey, it's the one and only DJ Malone. And your girl, Ebony. Shout out to Radio, when I come right back, let go. <laughs>